Hello traders, Kelly254 here and today I'm going to show you how to create a bot that uses Martingale twice after a loss and goes back to the initial stake. That is, uh, it will uh, it will go, it will uh, reset uh, after two uh, two losses, that is the Martingale losses. Yeah, there's the normal loss that is the first loss that is the initial stake the second uh, <clears throat> the second loss is the the first martingale and the third loss is the second martingale so after two martingale trades it resets the stake to it resets the stake to the initial stake if you have not uh, recovered the loss if you have not won any contract so let's get started it was about that was requested right over right over here here and uh, let me show you how to create such a bot. Uh, first thing first is to reset this bot right over here and uh, we do not need the sell conditions unless you are dealing with uh, other contract types maybe and maybe the contract time it is in a minute there's no a specific market that has a ticks as the duration and as a sell condition or, or sell option so let's go to digits and uh, i'll choose to you to demonstrate using even odd because uh, it, he or she did not specify the market that wants so let's head over to adding the the variables that we want you will start with stake Martingale stake we need Martingale size we also need a loss count and let's start first thing first is to set our stake set our stake to maybe something like ten dollars like that we also need to set to set our martingale stake to stake like that we also need to attach our martingale stake to our stake here so that the bot uses the stake that we have used right over here we also need to set our martingale size to two we also need to set our loss count to zero loss count to zero like like that now we need to attach some few variable some few logics on the restarting conditions so we go to logic if we need to go to contract and pick a result is win else if result is win we need the bot to always uh, set our martingale stake to stake meaning that it will uh, uh, initialize our stake again back to 10 back to our stake which is 10 dollars and uh, if the result is a loss we need it to change to change our martingale stake by our martingale size so variables we pick martingale stake multiplied by martingale size like that uh, we also need to change uh, to change loss count by one like that change loss count by one uh, we also need another logic so that uh, if uh, the losses ex exceed three losses then uh, automatically the bot will return or will uh, set the martingale stake to our initial stake so if if loss count variables if loss count is greater than if you want it to be after two losses then you just put um, just put one right over here meaning that automatically the bot will uh, reset the stake after the first and the second loss 
but now it will not be effective uh, as requested because it will only uh, increase the stake by only one uh, that is only first martingale whereby if you are using ten dollars then you lose the first ten dollars and uh, the next contract it is takes with 20 assuming you lose the 20 the next contract now it resets the stake back to the initial stake but uh assuming now we are using two with greater than two now the boat will run the first contract maybe you lose ten dollars the second contract is supposed to stake with 20 if you lose the 20 now it goes to 40 and if you lose the 40 now it is it resets the stake back to the initial stake yeah but if you want it to be resetting after the two losses, you can always adjust year to one or change loss count to one right over there. It will uh, work the same. And um, attach it right over there. If a uh, loss count is greater than two, then set martingale stake to stake. We also need to set our loss count to loss count to zero once the result is a win meaning that at any point the bot wins it will always reset the loss count to zero uh, another thing now once uh, you have gone the two losses let me just run the bot and see what i'm trying to explain the first contract was a loss we lost the second one if uh, this point was one then it would have reset the stake back to ten dollars but you can clearly see it did not reset the stake and it went it went on to forty dollars and on winning it will repeat the same same cycle that was initially yeah that's uh maybe what he or she requested or else if you want to adjust here to let me just show you if we change this one to one let me show you the other the other option the first contract we won the second contract won third fourth uh, you can see we lost one contract supposed to multiply the stake uh, it is recovered supposed to go back to 10 uh, it lost the 10 it recovered on the next one i wanted to make two consecutive losses you, you can clearly see now it's supposed to go back to 10 like that you see the difference between uh if you want it exactly two losses, there's two losses and there's two martingale trades. Yeah, that's how you can play along with the with the bot. Uh, there's also another option. Let me just show you uh, all at once. The other option is whereby uh, after assuming that you go, you are going too many consecutive losses and you want it to be repeating the cycle again you don't want it once it resets the stake to initial stake to continue trading with the initial stake you want it to after it resets the stake to the initial stake it starts again the martingale cycle all what uh, you will do is duplicate this loss count and attach it right right over there then reset our our boat let me show you what the boat will will do now assuming that we go several consecutive losses the first loss we recovered the first loss second loss supposed to reset the stake we recovered assuming we did not recover now it could have used it could have gone back to twenty dollars it could not have continued staking with the initial ten dollars the second loss it has uh, recovered again on winning now it continuously uses the, the ten dollars let's wait and see if we'll have at least uh, 
four consecutive losses, uh, it's supposed to go back to twenty dollars. Can clearly see it went back to twenty dollars. It will not keep on repeating the cycle of 10, 20, 10, 20, 10, 20 until you recover. Uh, the you recover until when you are you win uh, the trades. Um, if you do, if you don't want that, if you want once uh, it hits the martingale uh, stakes, or when it makes the the first uh, uh, losses that you want to continue now using the initial stake, uh, you can always delete this loss count from this block right over here, and also remember to attach this block below the martingale stake. Once you attach it right over here, it will not take effect. Yeah, that's it. Make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more informative content like this. And also um, comment the next logic that you want to see. Make sure to be direct. Uh, we know what you want. Make sure to be direct. Don't like this. You can see that I used my own market. Did not specify which market uh, he, may, he or she meant. And that's, that's it for today.